Hello everyone, this is the third part of how to solo against Rio, and in this video we're gonna take a look at the rifles. Other ones are shotguns and snipers, they are quite simple, you know, you can get advantage by playing your own playstyle, but with rifles it's quite difficult, because if you get too close, you get killed by shotguns, if you get too far, well, you get sniped by scopes. So rifles are the most difficult to play as a solo, but you can still manage to win. So any of those rifles are pretty good, and it mostly depends on your playstyle and what you like. To be honest, all of those rifles in hunt, they work. It's only up to you what you prefer. Do you prefer a single shot with high damage, or maybe something with a faster fire rate like Winfield? It's really up to you. But based on the main weapon you take, you should take your secondary. If you take single shot high damage rifles, your secondary should be something with, with fast fire rate, so Bornheim, Officer, New Army. Or if you have anything, I would recommend Caldwell Conversion Pistol. Not the Chen Pistol, because the Chen Pistol has slower fire rate and wider spread, and the conversion has the fastest fire rate and the least spread out of all fanning pistols, so this one is the best for fanning. So the first loadout I'm gonna show you is Martini with conversion with fanning. Next loadout is gonna be without fanning, free hunter, maybe just necromancer. But uh, as you can see I have some trades here, so that's gonna help me a lot. But uh, Martini is pretty cheap, it's long ammo rifle with high damage, fast reload. And as I said, this pistol is the best for fanning, so this is a great rifle loadout if you wanna play as a solo. Okay, so we are in, it's double boss, which is great for solos. But the extractions are not great, well... We'll see where is the boss, I guess I'll go for the big one. But I have a 50 meter serpent. You can just run around it. I don't get M punched. Oh, that's good. It's, it's okay, there is extraction pretty close. Let me just take the two for... Another 5 minutes of stamina. I have stick bomb as well, so I can kill the boss. But obviously, if you play solo, it's also great to bring traps. I just don't use traps because. I feel like for me, they never work. Oh my god. I don't know where they're coming from, but I think it was. I'm gonna go on top. Oh, they beat the link. I'm not gonna peek until I hear steps, so I know exactly where to PDM. Okay, I hear steps there. Winfield. Another beetle, it seems like. So it's at least two. Let's try to bait some shots. One is Winfield, the other one, I don't know. Hi, right, Martin is great because there is so much ammo. You can try to wall bank a lot. Yeah, I don't want to pick this. There is a whole people peek under the door, but it's quite obvious and a lot of people know about it. Okay, so two intrudes. I'm not gonna add a peek, I'm just gonna regen myself. Chill a bit. Oh, two teams. So this team is sandwiched. They are sandwiched by the other team behind them. Wait. So the best scenario here is let them fight and just third party. Or if you hear someone get tagged, you can peek, you know, maybe finish them off. Yeah, so I think one player died from each team. Okay, well. That's one dead. 
One got rest. I don't know which skin, but he's gonna be one tap to body now. Okay, so one team is wiped. And one of those guys is one tap. Don't know which one though. Yeah, I don't wanna repeat this mango multiple times. I'll just wait for banish. Can take this as well. Okay, let's get a bounty. Might be safer. Yeah, they think I'm teammates of those guys, so that's good. I can play by myself. Oh, it's only one actually. So it's two duos, but I'm playing trios. Oh, okay, guys, two, never mind. Okay, let's. You always wanna try to fight one at a time. Okay, that, that's good. Good to know that this guy isn't the one missing bar. Got him. <laughs> Got him somehow. Yeah, that's that's very nice if you play like Sparks or any one-shot rifle that does high damage. And you're fanning, conversion especially. You can just, you know, after attack, instead of aiming, you can just go full fanning and you're most likely gonna hit them. Okay, so it's last one. She's gonna go this way, bomb, one tap. There we go. I couldn't explain what I wanted, but... Yeah, I knew she is one tap, right? So I didn't have to aim for the head. I had her going there, so I pre aimed the location and just body shot her. Simple. Simple as that. But if there's no one around, I guess I'll loot and extract. But yeah, notice that every time I peek, I don't full expose myself like this in the window, like so they can see me from every angle. But I peek based on the audio. So you always wanna try to like stay in the cover most of the time. And just peek based on that. So if I hear like steps there, I'm gonna peek like this. You know, if I hear steps there, I don't wanna peek like this to exploit myself. Because so you always wanna try to have one v one fights as a solo. Okay, game number two, and yeah, let's take this hunter. And this time I'm gonna play with Winfield. So as a solo with Winfield, you probably wanna take Winnie C. You might be asking why why Winnie C? Why not one of those Winfields? Well, Winnie C. There is a one trick. It has 28 bullets in reserve, and as you can see other windfields have only 20. Which means that if you pick up ammo box, you're gonna get more ammo from ammo box for this windfield. Because the ammo you get back is based on your reserve ammo. So only this number matters, 28, this one is 20. So this means you're gonna get more ammo from ammo boxes. And you probably won't even need like more than 8 bullets if you're fighting as a solo, because you can reload. It's not that slow, so it's fine. Just take Winnie C, it's cheaper as well. But definitely you wanna take high velocity or FMJ. It depends what you prefer, but normally on Winfield, it doesn't provide any advantage. Like, if you take FMJ, it's a bit slower, but the penetration and higher damage on distance is way, way better than normal ammo. But honestly, I prefer high velocity because the bullet will be the same speed as Mosin, for example. So you don't need to lead that much and yeah, it's very fast. So again, you have a rifle and you want to have something at close range. So either like fanning, but this time I'm not gonna take fanning. I think I'm gonna take hand crossbow, which is pretty underrated secondary. Hand crossbow can want up to body up to like, I don't know how many meters, but it's very strong. Maybe up to even 20 meters, you can one shot someone to body. But of course, there is a risk that you're gonna hit arm and the arm shot, it won't kill anyone. But I'll try with hand crossbow. It's very, very cheap loadout like this and pretty effective as well. Okay, threat. I'm gonna take back my windfield. But I'm gonna leave the shotgun here in case I need it. But yeah, once it's red and you are a solo fighting boss and you cannot finish it, I guess go out. Because it's too risky. Don't know where they're coming from. Okay, so far I hear no one. Okay, team from Logbay, but 
That's a different team, I think. That's not the same team that that is inside or close somewhere. I'll just wait a bit. They don't know I'm here, so maybe I can take like one surprise shot. They're burning something. Okay, well, I don't know what they burned. Also, other team is there. Nice. And take the shot. Okay, well, let's wait on the stairs. I wish I had a shotgun now, but that's fine, that's fine. Okay, they're going downstairs on the stairs. Oh, okay. Oh, they are fighting there, nice. Actually, perfect for me. Ah, oh, there is med kit. Can take this one. She has more than I don't know what secondary. Uppercut. Okay. He's coming on the stairs here. I need some better position. Ah, I missed. I don't know if she has fanning. She went downstairs. Let's try to go from this angle. If they are still fighting, I don't know, but... Again, I'm gonna blend in into the fight. So in case I die, I can just revive safely. Hmm, that's unlucky. I don't wanna go in. It's a trio there, I'm solo. Yeah. Let's try to go different angle again. I don't know if they... They're probably still fighting. Okay, let's try to go from here. Maybe in the back of someone, who knows. Okay, there is someone outside, well... Let's go fight this guy then. I think... Yeah, yeah, there was, there was. Oh, it's an another team. Yeah, that isn't that great because I'm sandwiched now myself. Just let's try to hold the angle again with hand crossbow. That's very bad. This team might be pushing me as well. Ah, it's Veteran Winfield. Or Veteran some fire weapon. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> I don't know what's happening. Ah, there is the sandwich. That's unfortunate. Nice, nice. I need to... I mean, yeah, there is... There is nothing I could have done. Sandwich by two trios in one corridor. That's unlucky, but... I don't know if they know I'm 
with them. So if I just wait until they have fight it off, I might be able to revive. So I'll revive in a while, see what happens. <laughs> Unfortunately, I lost the big bar, so I'm gonna be one tap to every single weapon except the dodge, I guess. But Mosin's Waterly, even Winfield. I think they pushed them, so let me try to rest. Okay, they don't have the bounty. They're probably gonna come back for the bounty, so... Let's see if this is gonna work. Black shot, that's unlucky. Oh, well, I need to get out of here. <laughs> they have both Mosins. I mean, actually, all three are long ammo, so I'm easy kill for them. I can try to bait them like this. But yeah, as you can see, I don't put my Windfield into the work much because. At this range, Winfield is kind of useless. And it was better. Unless I had levering. Which I don't. Yeah, so... Let me try to go here. There is like one trick that sometimes works, but if you stand on top of the bounty like this... You know, people usually scan like this, they might not see you on their screen. But it's like very low chance to happen. It happened to me once though. In still water, and they scanned, and I was on top, so they didn't see me. But those guys are all six stars for sure. But I don't think it's gonna work. Wait, there is someone else still. Okay, is that the bounty? Or is the Blanchard bounty? <laughs> oh no. Well, again, I'll hope they're gonna fight each other. That is your long ammo. Oh, they... they died. Oh no, okay. Unlucky. But I, sh I think I should be good to rest, because there are still two teams fighting. Now the rest. There we go. Let's just put the jewel through. Now the best play would be... Take the bounty. Oh my god, and try to run. Okay. Let's try, let's try. That's way easier to do if you have Serpent. Yes, it's very... I don't think I'll be able to run. I might chase me. But at least try to reposition to some different compound. But yeah, you saw I didn't engage in true fights. I only engaged when they were fighting each other, so create more confusion and that way no one was camping my body. That's the best way to attack as a solo. And you see, I made it out. I died two times, I had one kill. I stole the bounty. What you can also do is that if there is multiple bounties and you have serpent, well, you can just serpent bounty and run away. It's like 90% of times no one's gonna follow you because they're gonna be in fight. They're not gonna check map if there is bounty running. No one really realized that. But yeah. Win is a win as a solo against trio. Solo against trios, you're gonna make so much money by extracting with the bounties, so 
I'll skip to the end screen and show you how much money I made from a game where I basically, you know, I was supposed to die, but still somehow survived. Okay, so I made 1.1k with 3 kills and 2 deaths. This was the lobby. I only fought this team actually, no one else. But uh, it was entire server there and still I managed to run away, survive with the bounty. But I think I'll do one more game with this loadout. Well, sometimes you're gonna get games like this where you kill the boss but you don't meet anyone. That's why solo against trio is way better than solo against duos because as you can see the server was full but there was no one on my bounty. All the teams were on the other bounties. So I made 1.2k for nothing.